Hi friends, good morning. Welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm here with some new nursing based multiple choice questions. Let's have a look. Question number one. How many vertebrae are in the human vertebral column? Option A, 30. Option B, 33. Option C, 36. And option D, 26. Answer number one. Option B, 33. Question number two. On which vertebrae does the human head rest? Option A, cervical vertebrae. Option B, cranium. Option C, fused vertebrae. And option D, atlas and axis. Answer number two. Option D, atlas and axis. Question number three. What is the name of the process that occurs during development where bone tissue is created using a cartilage template? Option A, osteon. Option B, intramembranous ossification. Option C, endochondrial ossification. And Option D, ossification. Answer number 3. Option C, endochondral ossification. Question number 4. How many bones does human appendicular skeletal consist of? Option A, 126 bones. Option B, 316 bones. Option C, 122 bones. And option D, 216 bones. Answer number 4. Option A, 126 bones. Question number 5. Whereby in India was the first COVID positive case reported? Option A, Kerala. Option B, Delhi. Option C, Tamil Nadu. And Option D, Andhra Pradesh. Answer number 5. Option A, Kerala. Question number 6. The most effective method to reduce the risk of hypostatic pneumonia in patient is Option A. Every 6 hour IV antibiotics Option B. Timely nebulization Option C. Oxygen therapy using nasal prongs or mask And Option D. Frequently changing the position of the patient Answer number 6 Option D. Frequently changing the position of the patient. Question number 7. Which among these is the correct method to transfer a patient with IDC, intercoastal drainage tubes? Option A. Clamp the tubes and place the drainage system above the patient's chest level. Option B. Do not clamp the tube and place the drainage system below the patient's chest level. Option C. Clamp the tube and place the drainage system below the patient's chest level. And Option D. Do not clamp the tube and place the drainage system above the patient's chest level. Answer number 7. Option B. Do not clamp the tube and place the drainage system below the chest level. Question number 8. Creatinine is the metabolic waste product excreted in the urine and derived from 
option a muscle option b blood option c bone and option d water and liver answer number 8 option a muscle question number 9 liver is considered as the heaviest and the largest organ in human body option a true option b false answer number 9 option b false liver is considered as the heaviest and the second largest organ after skin in size question number 10 vitamin d is converted into calcitrol a biologically active form of vitamin d in option a liver option b long bone option c rbc's that is red blood cells and option d kidneys answer number 10 option d kidneys question number 11 which among these is a small bone present in the skull that separates nasal cavity from the brain option a frontal bone option b sphenoid bone option c ethmoid bone and option d zygomatic bone answer number 11 option c ethmoid bone question number 12 which among these is a water soluble vitamin option a vitamin a option b vitamin b option c vitamin d and option d vitamin k answer number 12 option b vitamin b Question number 13. Wet beriberi, a condition caused by the deficiency of vitamin B1, affect the organ of the Option A. Circulatory system Option B. Nervous system Option C. Musculoskeletal system and Option D. Respiratory system Answer number 13. Option A. Circulatory System Question number 14 Antibiotics are used to treat infections caused by Option A. Bacteria Option B. Protozoan Option C. All of the above and Option D. None of the above Answer number 14 Option A Bacteria Question number 15 The most common side effect of beta lactam antibiotics is Option A Dizziness Option B Hypertension Option C Allergic Reaction and Option D Hair Loss Answer number 15 Option C Allergic Reaction Question number 16 Which among these is an important product of the curb cycle? Option A Oxygen Option B ATP Option C Methane and Option D None of the above Answer number 16 Option B ATP Question number 17 
The technique by which the plants are grown with their roots suspended in the air is called Option A. Osmosis Option B. Diffusion Option C. Aerophonics and Option D. Aerosolization Answer number 17 Option C. Aerophonics Question number 18 the leaves develop dark green coloration due to the deficiency of Option A. Sodium Option B. Phosphorus Option C. Nitrogen and Option D. Sulfur Answer number 18 Option B. Phosphorus Question number 19 Digestion of proteins occur in Option A. Liver Option B. Esophagus Option C. Stomach and Option D. Ileum Answer number 19 Option D. Ileum Question number 20 Jellyfish breathe through Option A. Diffusion Option B. Lungs Option C. Gills and Option D. Osmosis Answer number 20 Option A. Diffusion So friends, this is the end of questionnaire for today. Please follow, like and subscribe my channel. Thank you all for watching. For the next blog, stay tuned. Till then, bye-bye.